going on JL fishing people out here on Carter's Lake again this is like uh, my day two of practice got a tournament tomorrow I'm gonna try to find some different fish than I found last Sunday maybe try to do a little a little different things but a hundred percent a hundred percent staying away from the deep fish I just that, is, that ain't my style but, uh, got a little a little fog out here pretty pretty if you ask me you know all right well i'm gonna park the truck and we're gonna get out there on the water and we'll see y'all out there well, that was about bad what two and a half feet from the water <laughs> might be my lucky day minutes then I'm gonna come back while it's still a little bit cool and throw a jerk bait around these uh around this marina see what we can get going had a pretty key follower it was sort of in the very back of a cove it was probably a three pounder didn't need it but i'm confident that if i come back here tomorrow make a longer cast and set up properly it'd probably eat again he, he was really wanting it but he hit he come up right at the boat and he saw me and i saw him and, but um, i'm gonna go up here and throw this jerk bait around some uh docks of arena and see if we can uh, trigger some really bigger fish that's out there feeding on shad. Other than knowing places where I can go to not catch a bass, I haven't completed much today or accomplished much today. I did get, uh, I got one bite on jerk bait and I had one follower on the wake bait. It's not really a catch or nothing, but it does give me a little bit of information that I can go. I can go to them places tomorrow and maybe get the same fish to bite. Uh, Y'all stay tuned. Maybe we'll catch a few fish today. If not, I got a few waypoints I can run tomorrow in hopes of getting by. Got pretty scary there for a little bit.
first fish in the boat this morning. Too bad. It's just a baby. <laughs> What I'm doing now is I'm trying to find some spots closer to that spot, like not in the same area because I don't fish at all, but like just semi close. That way I'm not making a run all the way up there for nothing. When I run up there, that if I can find some more spots, I can hit these spots along with that one, and I'm not, I'm not wasting all that time. I have a uh, I have some more spots I can hit once I'm up there. I don't know how I didn't get a bite in there. That looks good, really good. So I only boated one tiny one, but all in all, it was a pretty good, pretty good day out there. I, I got some really key bites, and that was that's important. So when I get home, I'm gonna put together a little game plan on some spots that I can run, put them in order and everything. That way, when I get out tomorrow, I know what I need to do, know what spots I need to go to, and uh, and that's it. Appreciate y'all watching. Probably gonna be a little bit shorter video just because. I was keen in on bigger fish, and of course I didn't want to catch some bigger fish, so I bit my hooks in and stuff, but it was still a pretty good day on the water. Alright, well, appreciate y'all watching. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe.